welcome to At Home with Lucas. So today we're going to be talking about Xfinity and in particular we're talking about their Xfinity Wi-Fi splitting. You may wonder why would you want to have two different Wi-Fi's? Well, I'm going to tell you in this video and it's very, very simple. The main reason is you buy a 2.4 gigahertz only device and you get it home, you're super excited and you find out you cannot connect it to your router because your router will not communicate with the device because your router is a 2.4 and a 5 gigahertz combined. That means it's automatically firing the 2.4 to the device that need 2.4 and the 5 to the device that need 5. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to split it so you can get those devices connected and get going, people. Woo! Build that smart home, build that amazing house, build that amazing whatever it is. Let's split that Wi-Fi and make your life easier. All right, let's go ahead and jump into it. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is go into your app store, whether you're on iOS or Android, and you're just going to type in Xfinity. You're going to click on Xfinity, and then you're going to click on the purple X, and then you're going to install this. This is going to give you access to what is called the XFi app. They now just call it Xfinity. So go ahead and open that app. Okay, then you're gonna click at the bottom where it says connect and it has that circle with those dots. Go ahead and click on the connect. Then you're gonna click on Wi-Fi networks. So mine has two Wi-Fi networks because I have already split my Wi-Fi, but you're just probably gonna see Wi-Fi network. You're gonna go ahead and click on that. Okay, now you're gonna see my networks and in the top right corner, you're gonna see a pencil or you're gonna see some kind of icon. I don't know if it's different on iOS. Go ahead and click in the top right corner and now it's gonna give you this screen here with a box in the top right corner that has not been checked yet. So if you go ahead and click on the top right corner in that box, it's going to split your Wi-Fi. Okay, so once you've checked that box, it's gonna now show you your two different Wi-Fi networks. One very important thing is to have your 5G or your 2G a different name. So you're going to want to name it something different. You can just do 5G and then you can just do 2G if you want. That way it's very simple. And then you're going to actually want to change your password. So you do not want your passwords to be the same. That can mess you up. So definitely change that. And then once you've finished that, you're just gonna hit the apply changes at the bottom right corner, that giant purple rectangle. Uh, once you do apply that and it's all said and done, if you have any problems at all, what you're going to need to do is reset your router. Unplug the router for 20 seconds and then plug it back in and then your networks should appear. So another reason why you won't see two networks is if you're running an old PlayStation and it only has two gigahertz, it doesn't have five. So some people have old devices that do not have five gigahertz and they'll get onto that device and they'll go, no, 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 it didn't split. I only see one Wi-Fi name. No, it did split. You just have an old device that cannot see the five gigahertz. So those are the two main reasons why when people split the Wi-Fi, they comment and they're like, oh no, it's not working. Well, it did work. Your device is just not a new device with five gigahertz or you need to reset the router. All right, there you go. That's the Xfinity Wi-Fi splitting. Hopefully that helped you out. Hopefully it got your devices back online. If it did, definitely click and clack that like button. If you want to join the Adam Lucas family and you want to be a part of this crew, hit that subscribe button. Every time I get a subscriber, I get a boost to make more and more videos. It's because of you guys. I surpassed 4K. Yes, people, on my way to 5K, but I need your help. Yes, you right there. Tell your friends, tell your family, this guy's on YouTube. They should go subscribe and watch my channel. But as always, I thank you for watching each and every one of my videos, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.